Hey everybody, welcome to the Wolf Pit. Today I'm going to show you how to make original buffalo wings, and we're going to grill them instead of fry them. If you like them fried, you're going to love them grilled, so let's get started. Original buffalo wings don't have any seasoning, so I'm starting with three pounds of naked wings that I've cut in half and removed the tips. I have the grill dome preheated to 350 degrees, and the wings are going to grill over direct heat for about 15 to 20 minutes, flipping about every five minutes. And now for the original buffalo sauce, I'm going to start with butter, granulated garlic, Worcestershire sauce, apple cider vinegar. The original recipe has white vinegar in it, but I think apple cider vinegar has a much better taste to it. And last but not least, Frank's Red Hot. For a full printable copy of this recipe and many more, visit the Wolf Pit blog. And here we are after the first five minutes. We're gonna go ahead and flip our wings. The smell and flavor you get from cooking these wings over direct heat with that fat dripping right down on the coals is amazing. That's a lot of additional flavor you miss out on when you fry them. I'm gonna add the extended cooking grate and the buffalo sauce. Now as the sauce comes up to temperature, it'll absorb that nice smoky flavor. Now after a total of 15 minutes and a couple more flips, our chicken wings are about ready to be sauced. I'm going to heavily sauce each wing and then put it back on the grill for five more minutes. Continue this process until all the wings are coated. For an extra layer of flavor, I dip the wings into the buffalo sauce one more time, and after a total of 25 minutes, our wings are done. And there you have it, a beautiful plate of smoky grilled buffalo wings with blue cheese, carrots, and celery. These turned out to be the best buffalo wings I've ever had or made. And as you can tell, my daughter and I tore through these like animals. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you give these a try, and I'll see you next time.